Hi guys, I'm Sarah. And I'm Christine from Glow Recipe. So today we're going to show you everything that you need to know about double cleansing. cleansing. Double cleansing is the two-step cleanse that you do to really make sure you're taking everything off. The belief is that it takes more than one step to put all of our skincare and makeup on in the morning, so that it should take more than one step of cleansing to really truly get everything off. Yeah, and there is a reason why there are specific types for each step. So the first step is the oil cleanser, and the second is usually a foam cleanser. And the reason why there's an oil cleanser is to remove all of your oil, which is your makeup, and all the dirt also from your face. And then the foam wash is to make sure all the debris is completely taken away. So can you use an oil cleanser on oilier skin types? Absolutely, because you want to remove all of your makeup, which a lot of it is made of oils, and the debris and grime from your face without stripping your skin. And when you strip your skin, actually it can produce more sebum. Mm. That's a good thing to know. Okay, so for the first time, guys, we're actually both gonna strip off our makeup in front of <laughs> camera and show you the two-step double cleansing ourselves. Let's just see how effectively the makeup gets removed and how clean our faces are at the end. All right, so I think we have to tie our hair. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so we're excited to show two new products that we recently curated for Glow Recipe. And the cleansing oil that we're gonna to show today is from Blossom Jeju. We love Blossom Jeju because they use a lot of ingredients from the Jeju Islands, which are the, I guess, Hawaii of Korea. Yeah, it's beautiful. It's beautiful there. island, really pristine, lots of great ingredients come from it. Um, and this uses a lot of camellia extract, which is especially antioxidant rich. We also love this formula because it's mineral oil free. And it's actually quite difficult to find a cleansing oil that doesn't have mm -hmm. mineral oil in it. Yeah. But we find that the ones without it tend to be easier on the skin and actually clog the pores less. This product has three or four ingredients max and most of it is made of camellia oil, which is what we love. Okay, so let's start. We're gonna pump three for me. And then, okay. So where do you start with your massage? So normally you start with the T-zone, where it tends to have the most oil and sebum. And it's actually most effective if you start there and then roll it out to the rest of the skin. And a good tip we learned from a makeup artist friend in Korea is to always be careful of the corners. And by corners, she means the kind of corners here where you have little fine lines around the eyes or the corners between your nose and your cheek because a lot of makeup actually gets stuck there. And she says that her clients come to her with bare faces but she can still see little bits of makeup left on their skin. So I'm rubbing my eyes as gentle as I can and I can see that my eyeliner is coming off very effectively. My eyes are not hurting at all. So this formula is very, very gentle. One tip to share with you guys is to use a Q-tip when you're removing your eye makeup. And the reason for that is because your eye area is super delicate, so you want to make sure everything is gentle, whether it's massaging or removing your makeup. So you can pump just a little bit of the oil onto the Q-tip. And then that's when you can go a little bit deeper between your lashes. See, it's, you can get the dark liner on the Q-tip. So we need to emulsify the cleansing oil with water so that it starts to come off. Okay. And then as you emulsify, you'll notice that your cleansing oil becomes kind of this milky texture. And that means that it yeah. is cleansing and also getting removed from your face. Exactly. We're seeing like the clear formula turn a little bit white on the skin. And then you use running water and rinse it off cleanly. And then you can follow with your foam cleanser. So we just finished emulsifying. The second step is to use a foam cleanser. This is a classic pump type and also from Blossom Jeju, which is amazing. So we're gonna use just a little bit. You foam it with water, foams up nicely. Mm. Smells really nice. And then once again, we're starting with our T-zones, which tend to be a little bit oilier, so you're really dislodging all the grime and the makeup exactly. fully. 
And then I like to go between around my nose so you get the precision there. And then I heard about this recent cleansing tip from Go Hyun Jung, who is a legendary actress in Korea, and she apparently doesn't go from the inside out, which is a circular motion that many of us do like this. She goes against the grain, so she goes this way. Because she feels like it gives you a deeper cleanse, which is interesting. Alright, so we're gonna rinse off the foam and then <laughs> Yeah, then we'll be back. <laughs> How do you feel? Do you feel squeaky clean? Yeah, I feel very, very clean. Woo! Feels All nice. Right. <laughs> so a couple tips right after you double cleanse. The first is that water padding is a huge trend in Korea. Exactly. So when your skin is still damp, women like to pat, 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 kind of, you know, dry your face without having to towel dry it and wick away all that good moisture. And then it kind of preps your skin for the next skincare steps. Yeah. So that's one tip. And it's just absorbing the water quickly without having to rub it in a harsh way. Okay. So before it gets dry, make sure you quickly, <laughs> quickly put a toner. We have a three second rule. You never let your skin dry for more than three seconds. So you have to act quick. It's a great way to use an essence toner is not only on the cotton pad, but also on the palm of your hand. The best way to get the product in is to press your skin gently. Mm, that feels good. Mm. All right, so that was double cleansing and patting your skin to finish off. How was that, guys? <laughs> <laughs> so I hope you guys enjoyed our double cleansing tutorial. If you've already tried double cleansing or if you have any questions, just leave your comments below. Thank you guys so much for watching. Get, Get your glow on! Experimental with some of my skincare products. I've tried new products that we were about to curate, which was actually a huge help to my skincare. We recently launched...